Hopefully we can get through before the poison dwindles down our health. Or before the Dark Mages decide, oh hey, we're gonna team up. Here we go. Crap baskets. Hello internet viewers, and welcome back to Let's Play Shining Force. When we last left off, we had just taken out a couple archers and a mage, dwarves and bats, and right now we are staring down two more dark mages and four zombies. They don't look like much, but they poison on just about every hit. And I kind of forgot the antidotes. Oh well. Hopefully we can get through before the poison dwindles down our health. Or before the dark mages decide, oh hey, we're gonna team up on Bolt. It's gonna take just a little while for us to reach them though, because of this very slow terrain. Bolt's pretty good at it. But the other two are still kind of slow. Because I guess they're not the hero. Okay. They can all move two spaces only. So none of them should be able to attack him from here. Let's see if this raises their awareness any. I'm going to say that's a no. Bolt should be. Yep, he's able to reach any one of them that he wants. And the question is, do I want to go after the zombies first or the mages? Hmm. I'm thinking I might want the mages. Which means I'm going to have to walk around. On the plus side, Bolt is pretty good at that. Let's head up this way. And let's send May down this way. I think I'll send Chris up with Bolt, since he's the one who's going to be hit the most. Don't step all the way over, you might force them to break formation. Right here, I am right in line where the zombie can walk up to me. Same with right here. I'm also right in line of the mage hitting me. So let's go here. Hope for the best. Uh oh. That did it. They're breaking formation. Ah. Oh, I didn't know he could move that fast. Oh! There's your demonstration. Despite how high my defense is, how much of a higher level I am, that was still a decent hit. Okay. Um. Let's kill him off. Gonna have to have May do the same thing down below. Good, still got the lance equipped. Uh-oh. That's not good. I might be losing May. Oh good, no poison yet. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> Maybe if I'm lucky the zombie will miss? I doubt that. Sorry, May. Did the best I could. Ugh. 
Well, that's gonna cost me another 70 coins to bring her back. Look at that. The zombies are still doing three points. Ugh. Definitely need to have him retreat right now. Of course, Chris goes first. Alright, um... Zombie can attack her from there. Let's put you here. And fast retreat. In fact, use an item. Because I'm pretty sure those zombies are going to be able to follow. Or go right back into formation. Hmm. <laughs> Makes me wonder where exactly that point is. Well, I'm not going to be testing that with Chris. I know she can get this close. What about right here? Nope, they're still going back into formation there. So that mountain marks the line horizontally. I guess. So let's put you up here. Take a step here and see what happens. No, it's not the mountain. So May's the one who triggered them. Huh. That's interesting. What if I were to go here? That got their attention. Okay. Alright, um, far too many zombies. I need to retreat again. So I will let Chris do the healing. Oh, great, he's poisoned. Ah, oh, that's what I get for testing. Why is Chris always going first? Well, no, it's not that she's going first. What am I thinking? She's going last. That's my problem. Ugh. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> hmm. I really wish it would show me how far he would step. Yeah, it'll be better than an actual heal. And I think she gets the experience for it, since she is a healer. Yes, she does. Yay! Level 3. Attack increase by 1, defense by 1, speed by 1, hit points by 1, metric points 4. Awesome. <sighs> Can't quite make it. Okay. Mm. He's going to be taking poison damage, so I'm going to be healing him constantly. So I actually do need to hurry up and get in kill things. Wish this zombie wasn't in the way. I probably wouldn't have been able to reach it anyway. Alright, let's try right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poisoned. That brought him closer. That's good to know. And he didn't use Blaze. Um, thank you. I appreciate that. Well, now that I know the exact square for the horizontal line, if I lose this battle, I'll at least have that information to fall back on. And I know where things went downhill for May as well. This guy's gonna be going after Bolt, so I think this is a safe hit. Hope I'm right. Five, nice. She's even doing decent damage against the new units. Finish off that mage before he realizes his mistake. Okay. Yeah, another two points. I'm more worried about the nine I'm about to take from the zombies. Oh crap. <laughs> well, I get to use that information the next time around. <sighs> goody, goody, goody. Why are these zombies so prone to double hitting? 
Yep. Crap baskets. Okay. See so you back on the battlefield. Thank you. Hey, level eight. Your hit points increase, that's it? Ugh, what a waste of a level up. Yay, level up. Another hit point increase. Not even much of a magic increase. What happened to attack, defense, and speed? Okay. Here we go again. Let's reapproach these guys. And hopefully. We won't lose this time. No, no. Let's not split this time. We're both heading left. After all, what's the number one rule of any RPG? Don't split the party. I ignored the rule. Give me the chance to bring May over to the left side. Hmm, <laughs> May's probably gonna go right here, so. Yeah, it's best if I just go ahead and put her there. Yep, that grabbed their attention, alright. Hmm. I don't want to go about this right now. What's your defense? Six. Nope. You get to stay down here. Hopefully they will avoid you like the plague. They should get the attention of the other half of the group. Not much. Hmm, still can't quite make it. Oh well. Really hoping to get Kristen on some of this action early on, but it can wait. Should be killing the zombie instead. Well, I was wondering if I actually got their attention or not. only doing five points, sir. Well, not doing five points, but bringing down to five points. So these zombies are fairly tough. It's not poisoned yet. Maybe the zombies work off of the same principle as the bats. Their crit hit is instead of poison hit. It would make sense. Of course, that would also mean that I am incredibly unlucky, as that's yet another unit that keeps critting against me. Hey, hey, an attack increase, a defense increase, a speed increase. Where were all these before? Yes, heal level two. That's gonna come in handy. Uh. 
Please don't miss. Thank you. Okay. Very close to having this in the bag. No poison. All right. This heal level two, same as heal level one, but you got more range. Which is very nice to have. And for only two points more. And finish off the zombie. Nice. Hey, we finally reached level 10. And it's just a hit point increase. Why do they keep doing that? Uh, oh well. Eh, May's still doing good. Let's see. You can move this much. You can attack to here. Let's just put you there. And put you there. Yep, that got their attention. Take out the mage. They should get the zombies' attention. Even if one of them misses, the other has it. There we go. We won! Bolt, now enter Monarina. We must inform Henri about Guardiana. It's strange, but somehow fitting. Anyway, I will end the episode here, and next time we shall enter Monarina and see Princess Henri. I don't think this is going to go very well. Her father did just die. But that's for next time. See you then.